What's the vehicle at the next location? Tow truck drivers like Chris McDonald are busy. Three days after the first measurable snowfall of the season, drivers are still adjusting to icy roads. One Midtown street set the scene for many car accidents Wednesday. This is my first accident. I've been driving here for years and years. The police officer told me they'd already sanded it once earlier and that they'd already had one accident today. But this guy was spinning out of control. This, this hill is dangerous. Just before 9 a.m., an SUV heading east on that same hill lost control and collided with two other cars. Inside, a four-year-old boy and his six-year-old sister are ejected from the car and taken to the hospital. Even with the gravel and sand mixture spreading onto roads across the city, one driver says it's not enough. The city needs to do something about it. Um, if, if they're going to sand it, they need to sand it more aggressively or de-ice it or shut it down. According to some state officials, there's only so much maintenance they can do before Mother Nature's curveball shows up. If we do have a lot of freeze and thaw type of activity, as you're aware, then sometimes that gravel, gravel or sand will go below the, uh, the water on the surface and then sink into the ice below. Even though tow truck drivers are navigating from accident to accident, officials say the number of weather related accidents decrease throughout winter. Reporting in Midtown, Victoria Taylor, your Alaska Link.